If I just slide this back, then I can get the bat, the heat shield first, put it together, drop it in. Yeah, do you like me to turn the radio on? No. I, I appreciate you asking though. Here's the basket. Well, that was about as awkward as can be. So the next thing is our super tuner baffle plate. And uh, you've probably seen me talk about this before, but these are tunable if you bend them by hand. So what I like to do is do about a half of an inch on the outside. You just basically grab these and bend them just like that by hand. Uh, you don't have to like tape measure them. If you use your pinky, put your pinky sideways on those and your pinky flat on the inside. They've got these little slots here because you might need a screwdriver to kind of get it started. Or uh, once you get it up a little bit, you can grab pliers or something and bend them up. But uh, anyway, just go all the way around doing that. You want to try to keep them all about the same. 
That's going to let you come back later and tune this if you decide you want to. You can also take and turn this upside down and just kind of push from the back if you need to to get those started. There you go. And like I say, just kind of bend those up, each one of those, however you want about a half inch and then about a quarter of an inch on the insides here. Then you can just set that right down in there. All right, now we're ready to put our cooking grate bolts in. Now when you get our slotted cooking grates, we send you these inch and a quarter long bolts. So you'll put these flange nuts, the first one goes with the flange against the inside of the barrel like that. The second nut, goes on the opposite way. You'll put the hex side up against that. So you'll tighten this one down first, then you'll just hand tighten this one. 